Alrighty, where where was I? <laughs> it has been a minute. If I remember right, this is where the uh, hotel was. Which I believe is where we're going next. This bar's been done in poor taste. Everything's so tacky. Well, the bartender will get angry if you mess with that crank. The bartender's really strong. He'd probably beat you down in one punch. Turn the crank. It keeps giving me these options. And you know I've got to try it. <laughs> okay. That's all it does. Fair enough. Ooh, there's a lot of people in here. Iron Man. The bartender's long-winded stories are annoying. He boasts about himself every chance he gets. Hey, I haven't seen you around before. Have you been working out regularly? You won't make it in this town looking like that. Listen, men have to be strong, you know what I mean? Or else, you can't protect what's important. <laughs> okay, hey, treasure. <laughs> Immediately distracted by a treasure chest. What is going on here? Man, I love this shop style. Look at that, the Iron Three. I've always admired them ever since I was a kid. I am who I am today, thanks to that comic. Okay. <coughs> Why did we come to a bar like this? We should have picked a bar with a better atmosphere. Yeah, now this place is... Definitely got atmosphere. <laughs> See, this is where the lack of background music is really concerning me. Is it meant to be like this? Because there's clearly a person here playing piano. So you, you'd expect there to be some kind of piano background music, but... I've, I've got nothing. Okay, I looked it up and this is... <laughs> this is what it's supposed to be like. Okay. Because I was starting to get a little bit concerned after, like, so many areas had no background music. So I thought, is there something wrong with my system? Is the emulation broken or something? But, no, this is, this is intentional. Watch out. This is a cargo elevator. You can operate it with a switch on the second floor. Okay, so I want to get to the second floor. Because I imagine that's how I get that treasure chest. And I want that treasure chest. And the question is, how do I get up there? Can't jump over the, uh, over the counter. Did I even talk to you? <laughs> what do you think of my performance? Deafening. <clears throat> Just kidding, this... <laughs> Just kidding, this piano is broken so it doesn't make a sound. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> that's, that's, that's funny. That is funny. Okay. <laughs> I'll, I'll give you that. <laughs> uh, uh, that's good. Right, how do I get up there? Is it even possible to? Doesn't so no. What? Hey, don't just come up to me like that. I'm doing dangerous work here. Someone like you touched it, something terrible could happen. This is a trap to stop to stop the enemy skills. This type is especially effective against poison skills. Interesting. So I'm guessing this is tutorializing for something. I'm sure it's nothing. I'm sure this place is not going to get attacked by monsters. They say Guinan has a love child. That's what my mum told me yesterday. And I heard this kid doesn't age at all. Hmm. Mum was saying that maybe it's a cyborg. I bet Guinan's kid is so cool. Presumably that's talking about Junior? Or I have no idea. This hotel isn't very popular. 
I guess it can't be helped that most of the tourists go to the other side of the city. Ah, yeah, that's the hotel. That's probably where we progress with the story. But, i got to explore first. What? I'm not scrunching for treasure. I'm recycling, okay? It's treasure. Trash, I mean. <laughs> Same thing. I'm recycling, okay? I'm working. Good for you. Presumably this goes back to the overworld? Whatever you call this area. <gasps> no, there's more. Do you know about this statue? Nope, I just got here. <laughs> This statue is a self-professed acquaintance of a classmate that lived next door to the second cousin of Director Gannon, who built this town. <laughs> I was wondering where it was going with that at first. <laughs> That's also quite a funny joke. I like that. So basically, it's a statue of someone who has nothing to do with this town. <laughs> uh, That's good. There's some good jokes in this town. I like it. This place, this is King's Warehouse. There's a swarm of thugs inside. You've got no business in there, you're better off staying out. Let's have a look, shall we? Hi there. This is Master King's Warehouse. What are you doing here? King absolutely loves cats. Same. He loves cats so much, he'd easily give up the life of one of his underlings for a cat. Don't you think we're really patient to put up with that? Sure, sure, sure. You don't belong here. You better hurry on out of here if you know what's good for you. Oh, but what if? What if I blew up your car? For an escape pack. <laughs> my my car. Uh, did you see the car that was there? Uh, uh, am I dreaming or something? I like that they acknowledge that. Oh. <clears throat> who the hell are you? Have you come here to see the great king who controls the foundation from behind the scenes? <laughs> what the heck is that guy in the background? <laughs> Dude, stay out of the shot. <laughs> uh, anyway. <laughs> I'm having a great time in this town so far. Uh, oh, he's back again. He's back. Dad, he's gone. <laughs> oh, God. <clears throat> Perfect timing. <laughs> totally. We'll see if you can keep that calm look on your faces after you've seen my power. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of my power? You scared? I bet you are. Cat got your tongue? Because have you heard? I really like cats. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, uh. Oh, my Francois. My kitty darling. Darling Kitty, even. I'm so worried about you. Wait here, where are you going? Don't do anything naughty now. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> what the hell? What is your deal? Dance, dance, dance. Well, pretty cool, huh? I'm going to spread this dance on the foundation. <laughs> You might want to work on it a little bit more. <laughs> what? Um. Talk to me. No, I don't want to. <laughs> Pink bug. D um. I want to see Tom. I wonder if Tom's doing okay. I want to go back to the Dot Colony. What? What? I'm going to put you out of your misery. God, what is this place? 
Hey, were you scared? Mr. King scared you, didn't he? Kind of, but not in the way he intended. <laughs> There's nothing more frightening than the way he changes when he talks to cats. Oh, that's a taboo subject in this town. What? This town is scaring me, but for all the wrong reasons. <laughs> uh. All right, what's your thing? What do you want? There's no switch behind me. Don't concern yourself with unnecessary things. Go away. It would be my pleasure. Oh, God. Now I've got to talk to everyone, because everyone in this town is insane. This is Master King's exclusive deal-making area. No place for tourists like you. But what if I went in inside anyway? <sighs> Hello? You guys outsiders? Seems like he's your first time to the Foundation. And let this knowledgeable old woman tell you something interesting. The Foundation, you see, can actually move around. I mean, yeah, it's just a space station, isn't it? I think. So yes, presumably, it can fly. You would think. Wow, there was so much to this town. Okay. Huh? There's a treasure box on the roof of this building. But how to get to it? I've lived in this town for years. I still haven't been able to get to the roof of that building. I wonder who put it up there. That is a great question, just in general. <clears throat> okay, before we explore over there, what is over here? Uh, okay. That just loops backwards there. Fine. Yeah, I wasn't planning for today to be an exploration episode, but I guess we're just exploring this part of town today. <laughs> this area is a lot bigger than I thought. Okay. <clears throat> what is it? I'm on break right now. Please don't bother me during my precious time off. I'm the type that just can't sit still when books aren't arranged neatly on the bookshelf. I tidy up every day. I am about to make your day so much worse. These books were given to us by the old master. Apparently, they're considered antiques on the market. And you just blew them up. <laughs> I hear you could easily buy a large cruiser with just the books we have in here. Of course, these books are meant to be read, so I would never let them go. Um, hello? Man, the boss here uses people like slaves, but then he says he's too busy, or, or too shy, and won't even set foot outside the shop. Good grief. Can I, can I, can I get, can I, can I get past you? Can, can you, can you, can you? You move. Can you? Uh, oh, oh! You you can do it. You can do it. Oh, almost, almost. There you go. Ugh. It's wild that that is a problem in almost every JRPG. <laughs> They never figured out how to get NPCs out of the way. Might and Magic had a fun solution to that, where you just have a yell button. Where you just press the button, your character shouts, and then everyone just moves out of the way. I love that. More games need a yell button. Now, I feel like I'm going to regret asking this, but what is this place? <laughs> I wonder if there's a secret door here. Can't open it, though. Hmm. There's nothing in here. Okay. The boss here says that skill should be learned through observation. 
but meanwhile he refuses to teach me anything. That's why I peek at the boss's work from here. Uh, oh, please don't tell anyone about this. I have terrible news for you. Okay. This is a strange town. Okay, so we're back here. Oh, there's a switch down there. So what if I press the switch? The ladder extends downwards. Hmm. Hey kid, what have you got to say about this? Oh, it's dangerous to stand here. Everyone hits their head on the ladder that's lowered from above. Ah. Yes, does not tell me how to get up though. This bakery is one of the best in the foundation. The bread's tasty and the cute girl out front draws in the customers. One thing about this bakery is that the baker is really odd. So is everyone else in this town. He never shows himself in public. There are very few people who have ever seen the baker, even among those living in this town. Honestly, that's the least strange thing I've heard all day. Welcome. Would you like some freshly baked bread? It's very good. My father is extremely shy of strangers, but he's a great baker. <laughs> uh, you're not going to sell me anything, okay. Is that Pac-Man? <laughs> sure. Johnny! You got a problem with me? If not, then hurry up and get lost. I'm not on exhibit, you know. Can't you even understand something as simple as that? If you're around, Mina will see me. Hurry up and get lost. If, if you're scared about her seeing you, why are you right next to where she works? Uh, this place is insane. Now I'm really curious about how to get to the roof. Dry cleaning! This is a cleaner's. It's not the short sort of shop tourists visit. I won't stop you though if you insist on seeing it. Be my guest. Ah, uh, the tourist view of the dry cleaners. Sure. It's very nice in here for a dry cleaning place. You know, I'm just a part timer here, so I don't know the details, but this family sure loves arguing. Inherit the shop, not inherit the shop, and then as I'm leaving, no, I'm throwing you out. I really don't know how they never get tired of it. Oh, that prodigal son. He's a headache. He makes such a racket saying he'll run away from home and never come back whenever his mother scolds him. And then the very next day, he's right back home. He's such a troublemaker. Really, that little troublemaker of mine. He never helps you work and just wanders off. I wish he'd be a good son and take over the cleaners. But then he's started talking about becoming a soldier. That boy's got no respect. I will not get involved in any of this. I'm just here to loot the place and to see if you have a door to get to the roof. And also I'm going to blow up your cabinets. secret door. Though not one we can actually use. So we don't have key number three yet. <clears throat> Ether upgrade, you'd love to see that. Should probably use some of those. But not right now. Where does this go? Because I am officially a little bit lost. Oh. Okay. Uh, oh, it's you. <laughs> sure. Um. Okay, so we've explored all here. Never did find a way to get to the roof, though. Hmm. 
There's got to be a way, right? They wouldn't just have this guy here telling you about the roof and then just not give you a way up there. Have I been in here? Yes. Phenomenal. Um, did I miss anything here? Other than these secret panels? I, I don't know. Hmm. I feel like there's one door that I've missed somewhere. Cause yeah, there's that. Wait, ooh, wait, can I? Oh, how do I get down there? Hmm. What about if I go through here? No. I got nothing. I don't know. There's a bridge above here, which makes I think we can get to it from up there. Maybe this is something that goes in from the other area. Let's explore the hotel. It's the only place I haven't been in yet. Maybe it'll open something up. Because I think as long as I don't uh, confirm any choice that's like you. Rest for the night. It shouldn't progress the story. Oh, a customer? Don't worry, nothing to be afraid of. That family's always like that. That's their way of bonding. Nothing to worry about. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, a customer. There's nothing worthwhile being sold here. You still want to buy something? Phenomenal salesmanship. What have you got? Uh, I picked up all of these ammo uh, from a shop earlier. Because you never know. And card stuff that I haven't messed with yet. Okay. You're right, you have nothing interesting. <laughs> See, did I tell you? Nothing worthwhile to buy, right? Welcome. You must be a director Guinan's guests. You've already received payment from director Guinan. So please make yourselves at home. No! Ah, I feel much better. Oh, Alan's probably waiting. Better hurry back to Elsa and start maintenance on Cosmos. No. No. <laughs> Not yet. I'm sorry, but please refrain from going back there without permission. My, my, a customer. Red to see people in this remote area. There's nothing noteworthy to, noteworthy to see here. Uh, if you're sightseeing. Everyone's been moving to the newly built sector 36. Good for them, presumably. Oh. <laughs> Somehow I've run out of space, even though I have a save file there. Fan. Hey, don't touch that safe. The contents inside are more important to my wife and me than life itself. It's not something for you guys to touch as you please. Oh. Is there a way for me to get back there? My dad is such a headache. The huge safe is so important to him. The safe itself may be big, but we don't have anything to put in it. <laughs> He's stuck on appearances. Please forgive my father. He's been like that ever since my mom died. Oh, I'm sorry that doesn't concern you. Would you like to stay the night? Nope. Um, I'm good. So I really can't get back here? No. Hmm. There's got to be way up. Oh, wait. Oh, wait a minute. There's an open window. Ooh, thoughts. Hmm. There's an open one. Oh, wait a minute. There's an open window there. Which means can I go in and up? No, there was no way up for me, was there? Because they don't let me use the elevator. The switch on the second floor, but how do I get to the second floor? The, 
I'm seeing threads here that there's so many things I can interact with. And there's so many things to do on like the roof area. And I'm just I'm just missing like one thing that's gonna let me get up there. One thing I haven't tried. Oh now you've done it. I warned you not to touch it, but oh it's strange. I feel really happy. I feel like we could become really good friends. Sure. I just feel like I'm missing something, but I don't know what I'm missing. I feel like there's just one specific thing that I'm missing that I need to interact with that will then just start a domino effect. And then I'll be able to solve everything. Oh, here. I don't think I've been up here yet. Uh, okay. Item allows you to catch fish with your bare hands. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I've been up here yet. This might be, uh, this might be it. No. <laughs> this just goes to here. Okay. At this point, I'm just going to assume that we can't get up there yet. And there's something for later. I assume, I'm, I'm, I assume there's going to be a, a story trigger at some point that's like, hey, now something happens that lets you get that, get up to the uh, the hotel roof. Because it seems like that might be the way to get up there. But they're just not letting me uh, through that part of the hotel yet. Oh well. I guess for now I'll just go back to uh, go back to the ship.